What's up, guys? It is Aaron here, and I got to tell you the truth. After every ice bucket challenge and food challenge and every other challenge out there that I saw on the internet, I was thinking the last thing I'm going to do is make a challenge or do a challenge. That's the last thing I thought I'd do. But after going into college and after really reflecting on music and every single implication it has behind it, um, I've really come to notice that music is very, 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 very much rooted in God. It's rooted in, I guess some people will call it religion, you want to like that word, but it's rooted in God. Um, musical instrument, music notation, music theory, all comes from the church. So when I thought about that, I was like, huh. Well, I know that in 1 Corinthians it says that I'm supposed to do everything to the glory of God. And I know that I do music. So, huh. And it feels like God just kind of put on my heart that I should use music and the growing, you know, trend of internet challenges to try to just really put his name out there through music. So basically, this is the thing he gave me a few months ago. Um... He gave me the idea to do an internet challenge based on music. Now, this is the challenge. The challenge is that you have one month on your best instrument to learn the first four pages of Flight of the Bumblebee. Ah! I know you're like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. But it's really, at least on piano, at least from my experience on the piano, it's not that hard. Um, it took me about a week to learn the first four pages and really be able to play it full speed. Um, and <laughs> it's actually kind of funny, the second half of that week, um, I got a pulled pinky finger. I know you're like, huh? Yeah, I pulled my pinky finger. Um, and I also got a splinter, and it's actually kind of healing. You see that? You see that? Let me see. Can you see that? That little black thing right there? That's what's left over the splinter. So I had a pulled pinky on my left hand and a splinter in my right hand. So, but I still did it. I still did it, and that's not me, you know, that's God. But it's also a testament to how easy the song is if you know your chromatic scales. And if you don't know your chromatic scales, then, you know, just look it up. <laughs> but anyways, uh, you have one month to do it. And if you don't complete it and post a video of you playing it after that month, then you have to do three things. That's right, three things. You have to read the Bible... It doesn't matter which part of the Bible, which verse. You just have to read something for 30 minutes every day for a week. You have to pray for 30 minutes for an entire week every day. And you also have to give $25 extra for offering to a church on Sunday. It doesn't matter what service you go to, but you know, you get the idea. And if you say, well, I don't have a church, then go to one. <laughs> Find one, go to one. Um, it doesn't matter if it's Sunday, Wednesday, Thursday, whatever. Just go to one and then give $25 to that church for that week. And that's it. That's it. Um, so, yeah. And if you do post a video of you playing it and you are able to do it, um, then you have tackled one of the most feared pieces in music, you know, I know, you know, for a lot of mainstream people, that's one of the things that's feared of all volatiles. Uh, but it's really, really, like I said, it's really not that tough. Um, and I really think that the people I'm challenging will easily be able to do it if they practice consistently. So these are the people that I do it. I know usually people have, like, you know, this list or something, but I don't. So, do it off of memory. So, here's what I'm challenging. I'm challenging Connor Barnes, Nick Cubitt, Jacob Hollis, and Dustin King to learn the section that you'll see me play on guitar, okay? And I'm challenging Dylan Baxter, Donovan Dunson, and Josh Horsley to learn it on saxophone. For piano, the thing that's near and dear to my heart, I'm going to challenge Shyla Alvarado, I'm going to challenge Michaela Cubitt, 
And I'm going to challenge my friend Robbie V. I'm not going to try to pronounce his last name because I'm very terrible with names. <laughs> but uh, you'll see once I tag him. Um, my friend Robbie V, he is a beast at piano, and he is actually going to Florida State, one of the biggest music programs in the country, for a master's degree in piano performance. So he should be able to tag this, no problem. Um, and those are the three people on piano. So you have four people on guitar, three people on sax, and three people on piano. So I hope you guys start practicing, and you will find once you practice that this is a piece that is not as hard as you might believe. Thank you. Thank you. 